Hello everybody and welcome back to Wild Flowers, where today we are still kind of trying to get uh, recipes most days. We are trying to cure... <laughs> I need to double check what we need for this. We're trying to cure the bunny ears. We are trying to change the season, which I need some cauliflowers for. Uh, did I actually buy the cauliflower seeds and plant them yet? No, I did not. So that'll be the first thing we need to do today. Definitely. Oh, it looks like I've got my tulip seeds and things ready. Nice. Tulip bulbs, wheat seeds, and more wheat seeds, just in case. I want some more wheat. I don't know. I just wanted to make something in there. That was all I really wanted to do. Um, I'll quickly head up the mountain and dig things up, and then we'll make a, a little trip down to Lena's and get the cauliflower seeds. And then I'm gonna try and make some booster potions of various types. And then we'll have another look at what I need. Is my... Oh no, I was like, has my booster spell worn off? But no, no it has not. We're okay for a, a day or two more. But it's gonna really start, start slowing down now because I think I've only got something like 15, 16 recipes to get. I may have already gotten all the ones I can dig up, but I want to try it for at least a few more days. And then when we turn the season, I want to try it again, so. Aha, they're all over here today, aren't they? Is it? <gasps> oh, it is. Well, there we are. We haven't dug them all up, clearly. <laughs> picklers. Don't know what picklers is. But yeah, do a bit more digging, do a bit more. I found something. A recipe. Well, there we go. Pav Baji. How are we doing now? Oh, that was my last uh, raw food. So three, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen to go. Someone was saying they got down to about 11 and they're now finding it really hard and they think that most of those 11 are going to come from uh, events and things like that. So, I don't know. I think they're a little bit ahead of me, so. That was good though. Two more recipes. I'll have to do a little bit of fishing later if I can, but uh, it's now 10 past 10, so I'm just going to run over to Lena's. Uh, all of you guys are like, why are you not buying leather from Kai? And I'm like... Uh, uh, because <laughs> there was part of me early on that thought it was expensive, and then I never changed my mind frame, my mindset on that. So, just just to make you feel better, let's buy all the leather he has. Uh, I don't need any more. <laughs> Leather's out of stock today. <laughs> That's hilarious. Okay, Lena, let's get some cauliflowers. Mm, I only actually need like two seeds worth. Okay, so we're going to plant those, give them a little water or whatever, and then I'm going to try my best to. I have a hair on my face, it's really annoying me. There we are. Uh, then I'm going to try my best to boost it up as much as possible to get as many out of it as I can. And then I'm also going to try and make it as fast as I can. So I'm just going to pop them in here. Planty might water them for me, but I'll just give them a water myself, I think. Right then. So I have... A miracle grow potion, but I think I wanted to see if I can get the bumper one. So to the bat cave. Uh, I have made some gold essence for some reason, not sure why. What are we looking for? Bumper harvest potion. We need nigella. Right, so a couple of nigella from Perry if possible. And Heather. Nigella and Heather. Okay, let's see if uh, Perry has those. Mm. 
Perry usually does, but it depends on the stock rotation on the day. So we might have one and not the other. Don't know. We'll see. What have you got, Perry? Heather and... That's it. Okay. I will buy your Heather then. But no Nigella today. That is out of stock. Summer and fall you can find it. So not right now because it is spring right now. Sadly. Alright then. Well, we'll wait and see if you have that in stock another day then I guess. We'll come and see you tomorrow. But we at least have the heather. So that's one set of potions I can make. Is it the... I'm hoping it's the bumper crop potion. Uh, I can wait longer for them to be done, but... Which one is it? Uh, of course it... Of course the Nigella is needed. Of course it is. So boost harvest gives you six. Bumper harvest gives you ten. I need how many? I might just need to do a third batch, honestly. I need 25 minus 7. I need 18. So if I did three batches of six, I, I could make it work that way. And I could make a lot of boost harvests. And then Ultra Miracle Grow, I could make two of. But if you... Honestly, if you're going to just... If I'm going to do three plots, I may as well just use normal Miracle Grow. So, mm, it's kind of annoying. Okay. Let's go back to Lena's, buy one more cauliflower seed. And I'll have three plots worth. And they'll all be boosted to six. That should give me 18 more, which will be just enough. And honestly, after that, I could probably have some more cauliflowers growing. I don't know. People are saying you may as well make a little stock of the things. To be honest, it might be worth comparing at Lena's, uh, to be honest. Things that you can buy versus things that you can't buy. So orange, lemon, apple, pomegranate, all of that you can buy. Sweet potato, spinach, onion, fennel and grapes and potatoes you can buy. So spinach, onion, fennel. It's worth doing pumpkins. It's worth doing cabbages. It's worth doing... We've done tomatoes recently though, so I've got loads of tomatoes. It's probably worth doing a few sugar canes. It's probably worth doing a few strawberries. A few hops. Some corn. I've got loads of wheat seeds. Um, more cauliflowers. Carrots and beans. And I'll just go through those and slowly grow them and just grab a few of each. I won't particularly worry about putting potions on them and things, but I will put potions on. I can't believe I've used all my Nigella. I probably used it on that stupid flower paper. <laughs> all right, so let's plant a few cauliflowers. They are going to take six days, so I would like to ideally try and speed them up if I can. Even if I just speed them up for like four days or something. I'll plant a load of those, and then I'll plant some green beans. Then I'll check on planty because, quite frankly, I'm not watering all these myself. Planty looks like uh, possibly out of gems at the moment. Your pumpkin. Some corn, maybe. So 
some more pumpkin. I'm sure I already have some carrots and stuff. So, you know, we'll just do those for a few days and then we'll change them over just to make sure I've got a stock of almost everything. All right, let's go get planty gemmed up. Hey, planty. Water some plants for me today? What's up with fishy then? Do you not have bait or do you not have a gem? You definitely do not have bait. So how about we... Maybe give you a hundred chub. And I'll take all the fish you've got. Okay, so fishy does also need. I'm gonna have a powered hey, sapphire. Fishy. Go fish. Alright. Mm, Feedy is not doing Feedy's job. Feedy needs a diamond 100%. Um, hey, Feedy, get to it. And I just want to quickly check your feed. 185. We can work with that. Okay. That is really good. Right, let's go and have a look at what we need for our lemon cakes then. Did I make the lemon sweat? Oh, I don't even know. Let's go downstairs. And see about making them. So, transformation cure. We just need wolf spain. Ah, okay. Could definitely head to the gloaming and do that. Um, sadly, the cauldrons are going to be needed for all of this. I've got six days to boost the harvest on them, though. So that doesn't have to be done right away. I would say making the transformation cure first is probably going to be the more useful thing to do. So maybe I could make more cauldrons. Let's go to the gloaming and see if there's any wolf spain. Uh, I did pick it yesterday. There's a chance that there might not be any left. But we should definitely at least give it a try. And then I can chat to the coven on the way out as well. So uh, wolf spain is in the second level, I believe. We go over the bridge. Over the bridge and then down here and get caught in some more brambles again. And get very cross if there's no wolf spain here because I've had to use up a load of magic. But there is some. Wonderful. So the cure should be completely makeable today. Perfect. I'm super happy about that. Although they are quite funny with their bunny ears on. <laughs> Maybe I should leave them for a bit. Because <laughs> they look really cute. Okay, so... I'm going to have a chat and see what people think about things. Rob, you, but... Francis, and soon Sebastian? I never thought our little coven would expand so quickly. This is why we all got promotions. So that um, when Sebastian comes in, he can be the initiate. So Francis had to go up to novice and I had to go up to something else. I see how this works, Lena. Can't it have two initiates like at the same time. Francis joined just at the right time. We needed him, and I think he needed us too. I think he did. Yeah. Violet keeps telling me I won't blow myself up, but that's just because she's already so good at everything. <laughs> Don't blow yourself up. Oh, what's going on here? Why, hello there, keeper. Hello, Guardian. <laughs> mm hmm <laughs> They're so cute. I'm still not used to my new title yet, but I figured it's time to do my job and fix that broken bramble mess. That's very true, actually. That is your job now. The townsfolk have been pretty respectful, but it isn't great that technically any of them could rock up here unannounced. Agreed. Can I help? Yes. I've got this incantation recipe that should fix it. We just need a few things from the gloaming. Please not wolf spain. I need that for like everything right now. And we'll need some special parchment from Wesley. Okay. 
prepare bramble recipe. It didn't even click how beat down I was feeling until Wesley gave the wellspring that boost. Mm. I feel like I just did a full body soak and revitalizing potion. That was so good of him to do that. Okay, repair bramble. So there we are. Angus has been asking me about Francis's initiation. Poor dear. They are so attached at the hip. They're cute. They're so cute, is what you mean. I tried telling Francis about his magic when he first moved here. Glad to see he's come round to embracing it. Hmm. Imagine if we hadn't had the Bramble Gate to begin with. Vanessa would have done so much more damage. I'm with you on that. Violet thinks she's found a way to repair it, so I'm helping her out. Right. Uh, home we go. Ah, uh, yeah. I can totally use all this levitation potion. <laughs> yeah. I'm not going to struggle when it all runs out. No. Right, lemon cakes. How many do I need? I need three, don't I? Ugh. How long they take? Six hours. So if I could make one straight away, I could leave the rest with the six hours. Um, that is my last forget-me-not, though. I need to be buying those from Perry as well, then. But I'll instant brew one of them. And then pop on another one. There we are. So that's th the three will be done overnight while I sleep. Now let's have a look at my Bramble Gate incantation. Um, I'm going to need... Oh, are you kidding me? Are you actually kidding me? Bumper harvest. Which means I'm going to need more... Uh, uh, Nigella. Rats. Okay, yeah, well, I'll have to see what I can get from Perry then. Um, did I... Today is Friday. This will be the first. Yeah, yeah, I did go to the thing. So, uh, to the mountains and got some recipes today. Let's see if I can get any more recipes in the lake or any different kind of fish. You guys think I might need to get some different bait going, and I agree that that might be, oh, might be necessary to catch the exact right things. Oh, no, apparently not. A speedy fish that hangs out on river bottoms found near the farm. You don't see many of these. Sell it to Bruno or cook with it. Perfect. A new fish and two new recipes today. Wonderful. And what did I say? We've got something like 13 or 14 left to go now. Well, that fish is like unlikely to be anything new and, and amazing, so... I'll catch it and head in, but it's always... It's always worth it. It's always worth a try. To smelt. I think there's like two things that come out when they're small fish is a smelt and something else. Um, so now we are only missing something like two river fish. And we still, because I haven't been down the beach enough, we still got another five beach things. I tend to go down the beach when I have more time, which hasn't been a lot lately. Time for bed. So let's go to bed. In the morning, my cakes should be already, and we can solve everybody's bunny ears at least. And then we've got to try and see if Perry will sell me forget me nots. And I am going to buy every flower she has basically at this point. I think that is the way forward right now. So, um, actually, go, go downstairs, grab the cakes, go to the mountain and dig. Toys. Give them all their squares. So I'll go in, in a, into town in a second. I'll go and see Perry first, and then we'll go into town and give everybody their lemon squares, I think. I think that's what we'll do. So I'll go up the mountain, dig up the dirt patches. By the time I've done that, it'll be time for Perry's shop to open. I'll go see Perry for the morning. Then I'll go and fix all the bunny ears. I'll be very sad to see the bunny ears go. <laughs> be so sad. 
So, so sad. And nothing there. Let's check over the edge here. Yeah, I can see the second one. One day I should actually go to the onsen as well, shouldn't I? Hey, just money today. As I say, I'm kind of expecting not to have tons of recipes showing up all the time. Two yesterday was pretty, pretty big thing for me, to be honest. Um, I'm getting a new fish as well. But I still need to keep trying just in case. Until I have all the recipes, I will try and keep trying. I also need to do some tests with some... I think it's apples, grapes lemons and oranges for the chickens so we could probably have them all sorted in a couple of days right then well natalia why don't we give you your lemon square because apparently yeah we're not going to see perry right now thanks tara you know these past few days i've really started to understand how everyone who was accused must have felt oh interesting everyone's staring at you like you're different like you don't belong Plus, I had to be super careful I didn't singe my new ears on the forge. Kind of hilarious. I want to see, like, if you've got anything to say about so, Marty. how to go with Sophia? Oh, Tara, she loved the pans. You were right. Knowing that Sophia forgives me, oh, it's a big weight off my shoulders. Oh, we're a bit behind <laughs> the conversation with you. now you don't have to avoid you. the diner. No more missing Sophia's pies of the week. Yum yum, pie of the week. That sounds amazing. So, uh, yeah, I forgot to go see Perry. So let's do that now before it gets too late in her shop shirts. Then we'll go and find uh, Parker and Angus. I need to keep going to see Ariel because we still haven't had Ariel's cutscene. So I want to keep like... Oh! <laughs> Well, that's terrifying. Jeez, oh, Ariel! Long day or something? Ay, Dara, my apologies. I didn't realize you were here. I am practicing my diabolical sounds. Well, it certainly sounded diabolical, so you, you're getting there, I guess. Other fey don't hear my cries, but humans are driven mad by them. <laughs> Eventually. You are in no danger. I remember you made Perry's, uh, Perry's dude run away and uh do these sounds have a purpose or are you just letting off steam why of course they do when i shriek i drive away humans and keep the land safe for those with fins and feathers sounds useful huh. that's a useful way of keeping humans from going where they're not supposed to go oh yes a sensitive instrument the human ear did anyone teach your cries to you no, 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 no. I came into being knowing Instinct. them. I lived on the bank of a river with many other Kurupiras. The other Kurupiras and I used our feet to lead the poachers astray. We used our voices to make the poachers think they had gone mad. <laughs> yeah, you can leave all sorts of weird tracks on your feet or backwards. It was just fabulous. It's a long journey from there to here. Mm. Very long. One day, I followed the poachers to their ship. I was investigating below decks when... Slam! The hatch came crashing down. Ooh. A few days later, one of the sailors opened the hatch. I screamed and screamed! Oh, it was excellent! <laughs> what happened then? He picked me up and hurled me overboard. But I swim better than many fish. I came ashore on the nearest island and I have never left. But don't you ever want to go back? Or get revenge on those poachers? Oh, I got my revenge. You can be sure of that. Oh, I bet he did. <laughs> I don't even want to know, Ariel. As for going back, maybe one day. But the animals of this island needed protection as much as the animals of my home forest. Yeah, the home forest had loads of Kurapiras, and this island didn't have any. They're lucky to have you, Ariel. Apart from, like, Kim and Thomas and Marty. 
I know. I tell them so frequently. Oh, that's lovely. That's so cute. I'm glad we we popped in. All right. So now it's Amira and Gloria, and that is that. Obviously, Kai, Giver, Damon, Cameron. Oh, wow. Look at this. They're not dateable anymore. So I'm wondering whether if you get to year two, or if you get to like the spring fling and everything, when Amira and Kim start to like each other, if you've not chosen one of them, they'll stop being dateables. But if you've already dated one, then the other doesn't, they don't get to get together. Oh. Oh, that's so cute. But Cameron, Damon, Kai, Uh, the only three now dateables so clearly they they need to get together into some like <laughs> i don't know there's probably other people they could get together with who ships giver and natalia <laughs> now i know that, that they can become like undateable anyway we were here to shop, not to speculate on, on ships. Um, <laughs> one Nigella today. Thanks. Three forget-me-nots though. So we'll definitely grab those. I'll grab the Heather, Poppy, Mistletoe. Mandrake I could probably do without. Crystal Ball Potion, Rose Water. Hey, Mint. Wouldn't hurt for a mirror. Yeah, restore magic, levitation. Um, why not? Buy everything. Except for the magic bean seeds, really. I'm not going to buy pine cones. I can find pine cones. It's fine. All right. Cool. We've got some stuff going. Shelby, I haven't talked to you in your normal form for ages. Do you have any spring traditions, Shelby? My family always used to do a dance round the maple. But every year, one kid ran to the center and got woven into the pole by the other's ribbons. <sighs> now we know where Finn got that from. <laughs> then you had to unwind it all and get them free before they'd start wailing. <laughs> Finn wouldn't wail. But yes, I'm starting to see who Finn has been speaking to. <laughs> That's hilarious. Okay, so let's go give out more lemon cakes and I will start work on a booster potion. I think for the cauliflowers, uh, I've, got more, I've got more instant boost, instant grow now as well. So I think... I will do the bumper harvest potions uh, that I need. What are they for? I'm I'm losing the plot now. Um. So. Oh, it was the bramble gate, wasn't it? So we're waiting for cauliflowers. I could just make them come along faster. I've got plenty of them planted. I don't need to boost them loads. So let's make a boost potion for the Bramble Gate, okay? Uh, let's make a boost harvest potion. And let's make a third cauldron. <laughs> Whoa! 
What do you mean I only have two pieces of iron? Oh, let's go make another ten or something. Oh, no, Natalia. I think she's only open, like, really in the morning on a Saturday. I might have missed her until Monday now. Nope. Uh, she's still there. Yes, lovely. Making all those extra spiles for the dragon's blood. Which I'm just leaving there, like... I, I know I can go and collect it whenever, it's fine. I'll head back in a few days maybe and just see how it's going, but... Uh... Yes, one more cauldron, that was it. Could I get away with two? I reckon I could actually. And go in there and yeah, I could get away with two. See now that we that people know about my my witchery, it might be easier to get someone to come and expand my basement. But what I want is um Miracle Grow, I think. Just normal miracle grow. Just take a day or two off it. I don't mind waiting a few days. So if I can miracle grow a couple of them, boost harvest on a couple of them. I think I need, I'm going to need three of each potion. But I will need to go get flowers from Perry to be able to get all of the stuff I need for the Bramble Gate. Do I need anything else for the Bramble Gate? Is that the only thing I'm missing? I'm missing two different things. One of them is Vellum. Which apparently is a Wesley thing. So maybe we should go and see Wesley about Vellum. I think that's the only thing I then need to do other than just wait for things to boost along. Uh, not Zephyr. Wesley. To what do I owe the privilege of your company today, ladies? Wesley, I have spoken with the other elders of the Fairhaven Coven. We have decided that you have paid enough penance for your misdeeds. Oh, nice. You don't need to waste any more of your werewolf suppression potion as an offering to our wellspring. Well, thank you. But to be honest, I'm out of that potion anyway. Perry tried brewing me a batch from the recipe Vanessa left behind, but something's off because it doesn't smell right. Hmm. I suppose I'm stuck like this for now. I'll talk to Perry. Maybe she just misread the recipe. I doubt Perry would do that, but okay. Speak to Perry to learn the recipe for werewolf suppression. Okay. Um, also, can I buy Vellum from you? Yes. Well, let's go and have a chat to Perry then. I need to talk to you about this potion, please. Perry, can you show me that recipe for the werewolf suppression potion? Wesley thinks it's not quite right. It's perfectly correct, Witchling. I put the wrong ingredients into the potion on purpose. Your coven had not yet absolved Wesley for his crimes. Hmm. To be honest, I still think you're taking it far too easy on him. But it is not my decision. I found this tattered page on our shores after Vanessa left the island. I suspect she ripped her grimoire to pieces, and there might be others to find. Ooh. Well, well. So I won't be able to make that for a little while because we are brewing a million things at once at the moment. Um, I think I've like literally... Perry's stock is completely messed. Yeah, it's completely wiped out by me. Got anything else to say though, Perry? Have you tried that boosted charm potion yet? No. <laughs> Not that you need it. 
Girls in your family have always been quite charming all on your own. Oh, he's so cute. Okay. Right, so now I need to go and give Parker and Angus their lemon squares. Get rid of their bunny ears. I don't know if we're ever going to find out exactly why that happened. Like I say, I think it was some kind of Easter egg miracle. I think the eggs, like, combined with the wraith. I, th I think that's how it worked. Um, so Parker might be coming back. Oh, what do you want, Francis? Well, so that cat's out of the bag. And there's no stuffing it back in, I suppose. Would just get clawed if I tried. Okay. How odd. I'll have to keep checking on him because there's something. Something going on. Where might Parker be then? Hi. Parker, did you have fun at the spring fling? Two things. Well, yes, but, you know, Lena and I went through a rough patch last year. I keep trying to find a way to tell her that I'm looking forward to us having a fresh start this spring, but every time I start to say something, I lose track of what I wanted to say. Maybe you should try writing it down first? Hey, that's not a bad idea. I could send her a love card. She hates the kind you buy in drugstores, though. Says they're cheesy. Maybe I could get you some flower paper. Well, I did just make some special home-pressed floral stationery. Seriously? You would make one for me? Okay, I want to say, Lena, I know we've been through a lot, but I would marry you all over again if I could. Oh, that's adorable. Will you drop it off in our mailbox when it's ready? I feel like it would be weird if I just handed it to her. That's adorable. Take this, Parker. It should help. Thanks. I thought I had finally adjusted to the whole my wife is a witch thing, but this just wasn't cool. No, not even slightly. Whoever is responsible needs to come forward. It's the least they can do. The incident I got back from Thomas's place, the kids demanded to know why Lena had called my stay a vacation. I guess we weren't nearly as good at hiding our disagreement as we thought. Your kids are smart, particularly Emmy. You would not have got that past Emmy. Kids are usually a lot more observant than we give them credit for, Parker. And I think the twins are especially... attuned. Well, my Emmy's definitely attuned to sarcasm. I've never heard <laughs> such strong air quotes around the word vacation before. <laughs> a love card can be crafted at my paper press. Oh! All right, I gotta find Angus now. Where might Angus be? Uh, maybe the bar. Sometimes. Yep. Let's sort out those bunny ears, then, matey. I've got something that should help, Angus. Oh, did Francis tell you I hate taking medicine? You didn't have to bake it into a lemon square just for me, Tara. <laughs> Wow! That was fast! Hey, do you have a magic cookie that gets rid of heartburn? No. No, sorry. <laughs> well, it was worth a shot. Francis doesn't know what to do with himself now that he doesn't have to nudge me awake from nightmares anymore. I think sleeping all the way through the night is a whole new world for him. Oh, bless. Yeah, since we sorted out the whole thing with his... Aww. With his ancestor. That's so cute. Let Gloria know everyone is cured. Okay, let's do that. I do want to just every so often check in with people because, like, actually what they have to say does change a lot and is good. Um, I don't know whether I can hand this in at Coven or not. It's kind of halfway between a coven thing and a normal thing, so we'll see. I'm gonna pick a few moon flowers on the way. Moon flowers. Got me through last spring. 
Our first spring is so hard. Okay. So. Gloria. No, no, we cannot speak to you about this at the moment. Okay, fine. See if I care. So we're just waiting for the cauliflowers, uh, werewolf suppression potions. I could try and make the card. Uh, I've spoken to everybody here yesterday, so I think I'll be all right. I'll be all right not speaking to Coven today. And they seem pretty up to date. They were talking about things like the Bramble Gate, so I don't think that they're like massively behind in the same way as some people around town are. Year three, Natalia, Marty, Romance. <laughs> Apparently they're, they might be making a year three, so if there is, I'll keep this safe. Uh, I'll keep it all installed on my computer. And then if there is a year three, we will come back and do that as well. Right. Uh, paper. I think that's one of the few. Well, actually, no. Check on the potions first, because the potions, if they're done, that would be ideal. So that one's done. Oh, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Just in time. They're all just starting to get done. Nice. Ten minutes remaining. Oh, no, 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 no. Cancel, cancel, cancel. Right, so I'm going to need a third Miracle Grow. And a couple more Boost Harvests. So that should be enough for my cauliflowers, just to speed them along a little bit. Uh, then it was just a case of the big boost harvest potions for the Bramble Scramble. And the Werewolf Suppression potions. So let's have a look at what they require. Uh, it's eight hours. I need Essence of Joy, Wolf's Bane, Ariel's Hair, and <laughs> Moonflower. Oh, gee. Okay. That's going to take a bit. I'm going to work on those after everything else, I think. Um, we'll need to go to Ariel and get some hair. So I might need to go and brew one of those a day or something for a little while. Oof. But that's fine. Uh, so what I probably need to do in that case, if I can, is brew one of these guys, but I don't have the Nigella for it, so we'll need to try and buy that where we can. I've got one big boost harvest potion. So yeah, I'm just stuck. I don't have enough ingredients. And I have the vellum now. I could do with a little boost of magic though. Um... Maybe we could sort out some of these cauliflowers, so... Miracle Grow. That puts it down to three days remaining. Perfect. Miracle Grow on you. And then Miracle Grow on you. So that gives us 12 cauliflowers. And I, what I need to do now is put the normal boost harvest potion on one of them. And then we can work on the other ones uh, once the potions are made. Perfect. And that brings us to 11.30 at night. And we've got honey and fruit and all sorts to harvest. And I, ha I didn't even get to see my chickens today. Didn't even get to see... To give Wesley a present today or anything. Wow, have some wine. <laughs> I really need to go to Kim. Problem is, I don't go to Kim often enough. Oh, I can't wait to drink some of this while reading the latest detective novels that came in. And so when I do, quite often a cutscene comes in. And then I'm like, oh yeah, done what I needed to do in here. <laughs> and I run oh. away. And I never get any meat for poor Wesley. 
Luckily, last time I went to Damon's bar, I got like 10 bottles of wine, so it's going to last us a bit. So tired. Alright, oh actually, I think probably the first thing I want to do this morning, pop down to my, pop down to my lair. I'm going to get myself the remaining boost harvest potions that I need. We'll need to go see Perry later, but it'll be a while before the shop opens. Uh, should probably go and see Amira, shouldn't I? Oh, do I even have any cookies? I think I might be out of some of the... Okay, actually, I think I need to cook some stuff for a mirror. What do you like? What do you like? Jeweled rice. Uh, marinated olives. Homey granite walnut stew and honey mint cooler. Okay. Problem is finding it amongst all of this now. I mean, the cookies are easy to find. I would love to give her some of the other stuff that she likes, though. Um, here we are. Olives. Couple of those. And then maybe... See if I can find the jeweled rice. There is, it is worth me going through people and finding more of their likes because apparently that is uh, like an achievement. So that's something I could just get on and do if I wanted to. Truffle mac and cheese. I don't even know how to get pigs yet. I don't even know if they're in yet. There might be a year three thing. Jeweled rice, here we are. Okay, so that's a, a four things. Four things for Amira that she would possibly really like. And if we get more boost harvest potions for these cauliflowers, let's just double check. I think I did. Yep. We're using the small ones that go up to six. We only need 18 cauliflowers. And then the rest can just slowly chug along. So those will now be ready in two days. So the day after tomorrow, we will have cauliflowers. And we can go put everything into the wellspring. Perfect. Let's go and grab the honey. And the fruit and then I can maybe do a little bit of a experiment with oranges or lemons or no, I think we did oranges didn't we one of them liked oranges and we did pomegranates we haven't done lemons or limes definitely and we I don't think we've done grapes but I'll do grapes last because I think we might have already done them so I'm just going to try lemons and limes so how about we do lemons today It's a shame once you tried them, they don't, like, go away, but never mind. Lemons? No. And then... Lemons? Also, no. Lemons? Also, no. Lemons?
Also, no. <laughs> okay. Ah, well. So that didn't work. Let's go to Perry's shop. And also Ariel's shop, because we need to start collecting Ariel's hair. I think you can only buy a couple a day or something. Or even maybe one a day. Let's see. If I can buy five, then that's great, but... Oh no, I can buy five. Perfect. Thank you, Ariel. Lovely. I'll need some wolf spain as well. Right, I need any flowers that Perry can possibly give me. Especially Nigella. Oh, lovely. I'm just going to buy all the flowers every day, basically, at this point. I'm just fed up of running out of flowers for things. I certainly don't need to worry about the money outside of it, so... Let's just buy everything I can. That'll do. Thanks, Perry. See you later. So that's my stuff that I need for the Bramble Gate done. Um, I decided that I'd rather make the cauliflowers harder to get uh, than... I could have used bumper potions on them and then I wouldn't have had them for anything else. So I kind of kind of made the decision that I'd wait a day or two extra for the cauliflowers and not have as many of them in the same batch. Uh, I'd use the lesser potions for that so that I could save up the greater potions for the Bramble Gate. So let's head down and make the bumper harvest potions. I think I need two of them. Which is ideal because that's exactly how much essence of silver I have. So let's make a couple of essence of silver and maybe a couple of essence of gold or something. I probably have copper. So let's just let them let's just let them sort of tinker along. Right. Now, Gloria? Probably will be... Hmm. Where would Gloria be right now? I'll try the woods. It's actually probably a terrible time to try and find Gloria right now. Ah, we found a mirror and Lena chilling out on their Sundays, getting to be one with nature. All right, a mirror. I'm going to actually give you something different today. We're going to go with uh, Zaytun Parvada. Marinated olives. <sighs> Just looking at Zaytun Parvada makes my mouth water. I wasn't too far off. Parva day. There we are. It's the perfect afternoon pick me up if I'm feeling sluggish at work. I'm not a counselor, but I think this place could use one. At least one that's not Cameron. One that's not Cameron. That Cameron. How dare he? Cool. So we are now up to good friend heart level. So I just need to keep popping into the clinic i'll pop out to the woods and we'll eventually find that cutscene. but i don't know where gloria is right now that makes it very hard to hand this quest in so not in the cafe not in lena's shop not on the bench not in the bar <coughs> excuse me swallowed the wrong way i had a massive tickle in my chest and then I couldn't get rid of it and it was like uh, Sebastian might be at home she might actually just be in the mayor's mansion right now mm. ah oh I want kind to spruce up home. the mayor's mansion Ooh. Vanessa's decorative style is minimalist Violet tried to help with that. 
She even ripped out the wildflowers Violet had tried planting under her nose to add a bit of color to the place. I believe it. I used to see her scattering them around when Vanessa wasn't nearby. I guess Vanessa was watching after all. <sighs> Creepy. It is. I worried that she might be too attached to the place, though. It was our home, but after being reunited with the kids, home is wherever they are. The waterfall looks amazing, though. The wellspring. Maybe you should tell her that. Even if she already knows it, I'm sure it'll feel good to hear. You're right. Life's too short not to talk about these things. Absolutely. Oh, nice. That was actually the casual friend one. Nice, 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 nice. I see that our bunny-eared enhanced friends are back to normal. Are they doing okay? I think they're fine. Just very confused. Me too. I can't imagine what would motivate anyone to do this. When we were just coming back together as a community. Thanks for all your hard work. You really do help lighten the load around here, Tara. I do genuinely think it might be an accident, though. Sebastian's getting antsy. I know he wants to hear me say that it's okay for him to leave, but I'm not ready yet. Okay. Uh, oh, actually, I should give you a present before you go, because you are now at a point where I need to. But you are the only one I need to give any kind of presents to at this point. And I just need to what get that Amira cutscene. Surprise. Violet's got me onto these, and I can't get enough of them. Food's one of those things I think I miss the most. After my children, of course. Okay, that was enough to get her right the way up to another heart. Perfect. So three heart cutscene events will happen at some point. Not in a massive rush for that. And luckily, it's like one of the few people. Let's say, when is Amira going to be open again? So Tuesday. Okay. Because we've had one cutscene in the woods, a couple, one in the jewelry store. So I'm thinking one in her clinic might not be far off the mark. Okay, so uh, probably worth heading to the gloaming to see if there's any wolf spain around. Because I do need to start getting started on those potions. And then two days time we can get the wellspring all filled up with cauliflowers and turn the season. Lovely. And we already had the summer festival, didn't we? Last time we ended up going to Ravenwood Hollow. That was when we found out about it. It's been almost a year. Wow. Crazy, huh? Um, Spain will be that one. I will need to do a magic top up soon as well. The wool weed is also super useful, actually. I should probably come in here more and grab that. And let's go. I'm going to need to do some fishing as well because there was a whole bunch... Uh, we need a whole bunch of joy potion. I've got a few, but I think I might need more. Uh, although I probably have enough fish. I probably just don't have enough. Okay. Probably just don't have enough actual joy potion, so I need to brew a bit of that. I can only do so much at once, though. Take on fish. So I got the wool weed, I got the wolf spade, I got a complifish. fish. I don't think I'm gonna try and get more than that. I I've got a feeling I have enough fish, but I just haven't brewed the potion up. And I do need to brew oh yeah, more levitation potion. Hmm. Should I have a chat to the coven today? Maybe. So Vanessa really wrecked the Bramble Gate. That's going to be fixed eventually, right? Lena seems stressed about it, which makes me nervous. Yes, it's going to get sorted. We've gone too long with that gate being broken. It'll attract dark energies if you don't get it fixed soon. Hmm. 
If he was really feeling sorry, Wesley should give <laughs> us all a discount at his bookshop. That's what I would do. He doesn't even give me a discount and I'm his wife. <sighs> Seriously. It's exhausting worrying over Tara, the Grendel I guess. Gate. I'm glad you and Violet are working to repair it. Tara is my representative in this game. <laughs> so I may sometimes say me, I may sometimes say Tara. Interchangeable. Oh dear. Yes. We will get that sorted as soon as we can for you. Sebastian's next to join the coven. I can hardly believe it. It feels like when he started school for the first time. Yep. Right then, let's uh I'll have a chat with Amira and then we'll I go hate and fix how them. vulnerable Vanessa left our coven. There might not be any danger to worry about now, but it won't always be so. Yeah. Okay, let's head back home. And do a bit more work on the Bramble Gate. I can't do anything about the cauliflower or the wellspring, so we can work on the Bramble Gate and we can work on the werewolf potions. And also probably pop on some levitation potions as well. Actually, the only thing I really need is two more wolf spain. Let's put the first one of those on. Um, yeah, you know what? I'll put two of them in. And once these booster potions are done, in 40 minutes time, we'll come and put another couple on. Or I could put... Oh, actually, yeah, probably one more on. And then I can also do a little bit... Oh, 30 minutes on those as well. Yeah, so I'll, I'll grab these. We'll try and see if I can make the bramble gates. Can I do the bramble gate yet? I can, but I'll need a bit of magic. I'll just take a magic potion for that. That's fine. Okay. I want to find out some more things that people like. Even though I don't really need to know right now. Let's start with Gloria because hmm. she's the one I'm actually still giving oh, presents to. I think I see something. Truffle mac and cheese. Mm. I still don't know how to make truffles though. I think I see something. Because every time I'm at Perry's, I just pick up a... It's empty. Okay. Let's do some levitation potion. Let's do one more werewolf potion. And then tomorrow I'll need to go and get the rest of the wolf spain from the gloaming. But I've actually gotten a lot further than I thought I'd get with those. I can fix the bramble gate if I just take my self a magic potion first I think it might need quite a lot maybe a max restore magic oh, actually it didn't it barely needed any magic good grief okay well that'll last me a while bramble gate repair spell done Apparently it won't get wrecked again. <laughs> and apparently I can try and find more things on the beach from uh, Vanessa. So that might be the remaining potions. From the grimoire. Or maybe the remaining incantations. There seems to be four more potions, four more incantations for me to grab. So uh, I'm going to put some more Essence of Joy on because we're going to be using all of that. For Wesley's potions. Uh, we're at 10.20. Uh, the other thing I could quickly do before bed. I don't think we're going to be getting to the... I don't think we're going to be getting up to the mountain today, sadly. But, you know, I won't be able to do that every single day. I'm pretty good at doing it most days. Love cards. So I need two flower papers. No, I think I will use poppies for it. And then I will use forget-me-nots, heather, thistle. Let me go see if I can find another thistle. It should grow in the spring, so I'd rather not use forget-me-nots if I can use thistle. 
Oh, really? That's annoying. Because they're usually up there. Okay, I might just use my forget-me-nots. And then we'll just... Like I say, we'll go to Perry every day she's open and try and just grab as many wildflowers from her store as we can. Anything that I've got more of. Heather, that's less useful. Okay, done the love card. So now I just need to... Drop it in the mailbox. Uh, we, we'll have to wait till tomorrow to do that, though, sadly. It's gotten very late. I could quickly give Wesley... Any luck with the werewolf suppression potion yet? Made one. Not yet. I'll bring it to you as soon as I have it ready. You're too kind, my love. More kind than I deserve. Let's give you a wine quickly. <laughs> It's just gone oh, midnight. I can't wait to drink. Come on, quick, quick, quick. I worry about your coven. I know how important it is to have a safe haven away from prying eyes. We're getting that gate fixed, don't worry. I totally agree. I hope we can put it back together even stronger than it was before. Right, bedtime. Is it time for bed? Yes. It would be nice to get that heart done before I hand in the werewolf potions because I imagine they're going to give a good, a good chunk of heart as well. Ah. Right then, let's have a look down here. So my levitation potions are done, which is quite good. My werewolf potions are done. My gold is done. I'll do more Essence of Joy. Uh, what do I want to make now? Ooh, I don't even know. Maybe I'll leave them open for Werewolf Suppression Remedy. Let's go find Wesley. I need to sneak up to Lena's uh, mailbox as well. Where's Wesley gone? Gone over to Ravenwood already, maybe? Alright, let's head over to Lena's house. And sneaky, sneak it into the mailbox. Sneak, 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 sneak. Speak to Parker, let him know the card was delivered. I just saw Parker go this way. Hi. I dropped off the card. Great. I hope she likes it. I'm sure she will, Parker. She loves you. Yeah. Well, thanks, Tara. Here, take this. Wow, 350 just for making like a card. It's quite good. Okay, so what are we doing now? Uh, Bramble Gate. That will be a nighttime thing. Season's greetings. I'll check on I'll go and check on the cauldron. Oh guess going to the gloaming. I'm grabbing werewolf potion ingredients. But like I say, I wanna go and see I wanna get as much like favour with Wesley out of this as possible, so what I want to do. Ideally, <laughs> is to get the end of that heart and then give the werewolf potions in. Oh, well, weed, very useful. I just need like two or three, I think it is. I think it might only be two, actually, uh, of the wolf spain so you shouldn't need too much of that i hope it's respawned i've been taking a lot of it recently so sometimes it doesn't come back in large quantities yeah it has one there today lovely i 
Uh, I could go and check on the dragon trees, actually. That's a thing I could quickly do. Just see if they're getting along. Oh, these vines are so annoying. Oh yeah, they're all done. Lovely. And I can put more on as well because I did actually make two sets by accident. <laughs> so... Because I've noticed a couple of things come up where I would have been scuppered if I hadn't have put all eight on. So I think it might be quite useful. If they suddenly want me to have maple syrup or something, then that might take me a couple of days to do. But these are the only ones that take eight days each. So it's definitely good to have these ones done ahead of time. It might be overkill. I'd rather have them and not need them. Right, all done. Lovely. So they're going to collect me another eight of those over the next eight days. And, you know, I can kind of set and forget, come back in a few days, they'll be done. Lovely. Don't have to water them every day or anything like that, so I may as well just make sure I've got plenty. So I've done the card. I can do one more werewolf potion. Um, and then I just need to go and see a mirror if I can. But that won't be till tomorrow, will it? And I may as well drop in on Gloria on the off chance that the next cutscene she has is in the... Yeah. Is in the office. So that might be a worthwhile thing to do. Some of the cutscenes... People are quite rightly saying some of the cutscenes just might not work until possibly the kid's dad comes back or whatever. So... That's entirely... I'm so glad to see so many fresh faces on the island. Shelby always says Fairhaven has a bright future. <laughs> but to be honest, I worry. Hmm. But yeah, I, I don't know with that one, because I, I don't know if Antonio will come back or if Antonio will just never get the visa. He was working on coming back, apparently. So that might be something that might happen in summer or autumn or something, maybe. You never know. More mulberries for me. Okay, well, what, what do I do when I've got time on my hands? I go to the mountain and try to dig up recipes. I fish for recipes and I make clothing. So let's try this first. Money. And some more money. Is it? No, a recipe. It is a recipe. Ooh. Spinach smoothie. One of the drinks. Well, yeah, we were low on the drinks, weren't we? We needed to get some more of those. Hmm. Two recipes. <gasps> A recipe. B -b Boti. What on earth is that? I am intrigued. Normally I'm not that intrigued by the recipes. What is that? Where is that? It is spice mince meat and egg. Okay. We like mince meat and scrambled eggs. Somehow? I, I, I don't even know. I'd have to look that up online, I think, and find out exactly what it was. Which I don't think I will end up doing. Two recipes today, though. So now we're looking at three pots missing. 
three frying pans missing. One oven thing missing. Four drinks. So four, eight, nine, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15. We're getting very close to the point, I think, now where we're going to really struggle. But that's fine. Right, Perry will be shut today. I'm going to give all my chickens limes today, I think. And tomorrow I'll give them all grapes. Hurrah! Layla's favourite food is a lime. Peepers is not a lime. Polly is a strawberry. Henrietta, let's try limes with you. No, so I'm thinking that Henrietta and uh, what other other one? Uh, uh, oh, sweet pea is an orange. Was it you? Henrietta and Peepers, I think, might be grapes. Let's try a lime with Luna. Mm-hmm. So I think there's going to be two that are like grapes then. Perfect. Getting there with those. Very nice. Okay, so I can't make any more werewolf potions yet. Uh, the cauliflowers are not ready yet. I don't think I can find cutscenes for Amira or Gloria at the moment. Uh, I think Amira, I want to try her clinic first. So I want to try that tomorrow. She might be by the woods at the moment. She might be in the woods and the woods might be a thing. I don't know. So maybe a bit of ocean front fishing for the rest of the day then. We saw Gloria and so nothing happened in there. So we're definitely not getting a Gloria cutscene while she's at work. Um, so Amira, are you over here? No. Where she is today. Bruno's over there, though. Oh, I wonder. Maybe in the gloaming. Okay, I'm gonna just go and see her in a clinic tomorrow, and I'm gonna just spend the rest of the day doing a bit of fishing down the ocean. Because we really need to do that. So it's 5pm. It's the evening time now. I still have, I think, two river fish to find. And five ocean fish to find. So I'm way more likely to be finding a novel ocean fish right now. And potentially a recipe or two. But like I say, I think they're going to become very rare and very difficult to find at this point. A snapper. I definitely have caught the littler fish. But, you know, I will try to. Once I. Apparently, the chub is the best bait for finding recipes. But I may vary it up if I'm still struggling to find all of the different types. There was a woman with wings there that night at the mayor's mansion, right? You saw her too? That was Perry. She wouldn't like you, I don't think. 
Oh, Marty, I... I can't really talk about that. Oh, that's right. You're one of the witches. You know, the thing I was falsely accused of being. Mm -hmm. I'm not the only one who's had a false identity around here, am I? I guess that's true, yes. You do make a rather good point, Marty. So I'm wondering if I'll start fishing up um, pages of the grimoire or whether I'll find them on the beach or what's going to happen because they, they did say Vanessa tore the grimoire. Hmm. It washed up on the shore. Although I need to check the shore in Ravenwood Hollow as well, though, because that might be what she needs as well. See. So. A squid. There was a time that would have been amazing. Which weed? Those scavenger balls are, are going to be the hardest thing to get in bulk. Also the blueberries, because they're the only way I can make blue dye. So I do need to come up here and grab them. I'm sad that I haven't been able to, like, return the lighthouse to its former glory. Yeah, nothing so far. No recipes, no new fish. Oh. You are literally the last thing I want. Oh. I could do I could deal with you. I think that those ones are always going to be Oh okay, it's a clam. That was a new one. At least we got something done today. Something productive. Oh, that one. Get off me, crab. <laughs> crab was trying to bite my ankles. And a haddock. Okay. Probably time to go home now. So we can try and get Wesley's final... Final thing done in the morning. I'll give him a present before I go to bed and hope that that will maybe give me just enough. I think we need to, get to end the episode as well. Good grief. Um, I hope it'll give me just enough to finish off that heart. <laughs> and then we can go on a date tomorrow and then when I give in the potions... That will be a oh, long way towards the to next day. I while reading the latest detective novels that came in. It's so nice to still have something to work towards after you're married. Really, it's one of the few games that does it. Um, I'd like you to have this, sweetheart. Thank you. Speed boost spells, you are the best. And there we are. So we can go on a date later on in the day tomorrow. We can actually go to the diner together, and then there's still another three after that. So we'll just keep working on those. But for now, it is time for <sighs> me to go to bed. Day. So we can look forward to the diner date next time. We can look forward to me giving in the potions, fixing the bramble gate, which we didn't quite manage to do today. I got a little bit too involved in the fishing. Uh, not gonna lie, but we got a lot, a lot, a lot of stuff done today. Lots of cutscenes done, that sort of thing. We now only have a mirror really left to get cutscenes with. I got the second heart cutscene with Gloria. Just loads of stuff. Loads of stuff got done. So very, very happy with that. <sighs> the bunny ears are gone now. <laughs> oh, 
Right then, so that was the episode done for today. So I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, then please do leave me a like below. If you'd like to see more, please subscribe. I'll let you know when the videos are out. I hope to see you next time. In the meantime, please look after yourselves and keep being awesome.